Hello everyone. In this session, let us look at some of the useful string builder methods like insert, replace, delete, and reverse. So let us create a string builder object. String builder sb1 is equal to new string builder. And let us add the initial assignment as learning is fun. Okay, and let us say in this particular string we want to add uh, that is insert something in between. So inserting some substring inside the main string. So that can be done by using sb1 dot insert, and let us say I want to insert at this particular location over here. So I want to insert at the location zero one two three four five six seven and eight and after the eighth location so if I say offset as 9 and what I want to insert is say learning Java is fun for example so what's going to happen in the insert method the first parameter is the index where you want to insert and the second parameter is the string that you want to insert the substring the character whatever that you want to insert in the main string so at the index 9 the new string will get inserted so when we display the output in the console for sb1 we will see learning java is fun and also we can add a space at the end over here also so string looks something like this so inserting a substring inside the main string by using the index whatever index you will provide at that index new string will get inserted that is about insert operation as simple as that now there is something called as replace so I want to replace something from the string say so let us replace this Java with something else so we just need to find out the index of J and A and replace those with something new the way it works is let us say SB1 dot replace then over here we have start index end index and the string with which we want to replace so that particular section in between the start and end index will get replaced with the new string so let us say the new string is learning everything learning say everything is fun and I want to replace the word Java with uh, with this new word so the start index for j will be in this case 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and the end index will be 10 11 12 and 13 so in java as we saw in the string operations end index is not inclusive the begin index is always inclusive so if you say start with 9 it will start with 9 but if you say end at 13 it will actually end at 12 the end index is not inclusive so if you want to end at index 12 provide the end index as 13 it will begin with the begin index begin index is inclusive but end index is always not inclusive so in this case it will replace the characters in between 9 to 12 with these new characters this new string okay and when we display the output in the console and run this program it will look something like this learning everything is fun so replacing some block of characters with new string so are you able to relate it with the string operation in the string operations for the string object also we have a replace method that will find some substring and replace it with main string it is not the case over here in the normal string operation let us say we have a string str1 which has something like this and over here if we use a string operation replace then over here we are specifying what to find say I want to find a replace it with say at the red sign so this replace and the replace inside this string builder are different replace in the normal string is actually finding something and replacing it with something but inside the string builder we are actually specifying 
the begin and end index and that particular block get replaced with something new okay so this is about the replace operation in the string builder then delete so similar we just need to provide a character that needs to be deleted so provide the index of the character or provide the block like this and that much number of characters from the string will be deleted so for example if you do like sb1 dot delete character at so if I say for example delete character at index 0 for example so it will delete this the first character that is L over here and when we display the output it will have earning everything is fine so L is removed so whatever index you provide the character at that index will get deleted so can we delete a specific word from the string yes instead of providing one index you can provide the begin index and end index and that much block from the string will get deleted so if you do something like sb1 dot delete start index and end index so for example I provide start index as 2 end index as 10 then the string in between 2 to 9 again end index is not inclusive so string in between 2 to 9 will get deleted so when we display the output in the console it will look something like this string in between 2 to 9 so 0 1 2 from R to these many characters got deleted okay and the last one is reverse how we can reverse a string so with respect to the normal string we do not have any reverse operation as such but with the string builder we can simply reverse a string by doing sb1 dot reverse so string will get reverse and when we display the output you will see a reversed string okay now with this there is an interview question uh, asked in a lot of interviews that how do we reverse a string without using the reverse operation from the string builder so if for a normal string if you want to do a reverse thing how do you do it so write a program to reverse the string please do it as an assignment and I will provide the answer for this uh, with the session material thank you